Howdy y'all! This is Rebus Raven, and welcome back to our swim with Sapphira School. Where last time we continued working on um, clearing out the grass, we almost have this little island strip island thing here completed. Um, this little island's almost done. This one is done. Now we're about to start kind of shipping the creatures on main island off so we can start to get them a little bit more widely dispersed across all the different islands because there is a land bridge over to this island and I'm going ahead and see what we can get done. Um, I did want to note I named this baby the first time Panda as in a, a panda uh, telescope goldfish, but um, I had someone in the comment section give me the name Onyx, and I thought it fit this adorable little baby even better. Troy Shipley, thank you so much for the name suggestion. Thank you so much for all of the name suggestions you have given. Um, they are really good name suggestions and um, they mean a lot when you give them and we, we put them on our creatures and, and we're using them. So this is the creature I went ahead and named Onyx just because it fits so much more than any of the other things I had and none of the goldfish names really fit her. So that's what we renamed her to. Alright, so other than that, we're ready to jump on in and get started. So, I think, first things first, we're gonna have um, Comet going ahead and scoot to here. Unfortunately, this um, Onyx does have the water body, but we got the hammer tail instead of the tail fin, so my conditions for them to stop having babies has not been met, unfortunately. I'm going to use her turns, though, to go on ahead and try to get more, and actually most of his turns, go get more of those berries from the berry bushes, because that's, that's food. And we're going to have Onyx over one. I'm trying to think of what I can have them do. Let's see, Aranda. Just enough strength. Go ahead and grab that one. And then butterfly. Go ahead and grab those. And then we'll have Tamasaba. Did I need that? Pretty sure I did. He is a goldfish, though, so... He has so many weird goldfish names, it's actually not that funny. So, let's see. We are trying to get them to a... Permanest. Let's get... Beaver on over. Because, watch, we're not going to find... A viable permanent nest. I'm at the point where we're just hopping along trying to find a nest. Okay, yeah, she's gonna have to backtrack and go to that permanent nest, I think. Me thinks. I don't have anyone on this shore. Dang it. Okay. Vandukta, you're gonna come up here and just hang out right there. That's your spot now. Um, hook. Yes, very nice. Uh, little baby Yeti actually has the water body, so we're not concerned too much for his safety. We'll have Hook come that way. Rose, 
your frog toes make your swimming skill so nice. And you have the medium body. So does your dad, Kamuro. But I do think that would take a day to get him across. So let's see. Um, Levi has a ton of fun with all of those. Um, Von Duke and Lael are definitely not making it. They just aren't. They don't have enough lifespan left. So, we're gonna try to fix their genetics and go from there and have them have a baby together and Audrey is gonna take care of it. So let's see. Um, eyesight and fertility. He would most definitely see eyesight as an issue. I'm not sure about his fertility, but I'm still doing it. And then for her, eyesight, fertility, and hemophilia. Let's see. She would see the issue with eyesight. I see the issue with hemophilia with us being in the water all the time. So we're gonna have her scoot over to be beside him and actually it doesn't matter if they're side by side because they're both sick already. <laughs> they can't get each other even more sick so let's just go on ahead and let them hang out. There we go. Finally got pregnant. One of them. And we'll have her sit on that nest, hopefully on the next turn, to be able to have that baby. So let's see, um, Pearl, go ahead and grab that for me, and then try to make your way over to do the crossing. And then you two are my diggers. And I don't know, I kind of see Kunuro wanting to stay on this island as well. Not just because he's a wanderer, and not just because he's got a, such a short lifespan, but he's spent all of his life on this island. I don't know if he would want to leave it. Me see, I kind of need to move to the next island. She's got so much life left. I don't know if she would want to leave either, though, to be honest. Yeah, the leech. Okay, well, my next set I was going for anyway. Thank you. There we go. Get all of those up. Do I have someone in the water? Don't. Let's see. Pedal. Mm. What can I have you do a little pedal? Oh, you can't even destroy the berry bush. You don't have a whole lot of strength without that. Um, Those horns, those horns have added so much strength. Okay. Alrighty. I'm gonna head and grab that piece of grass. <laughs> I swear, Joe, you're never gonna get away from that spot. Never. String. Go 
ahead and get you on back down this direction. And then I think you guys are just cautiously trying to make your way down to take care of those last pieces of grass for us. And maybe come get some acorns from this tree. There you go. Same thing for shark. Coral, I'm sorry buddy, I'm just gonna stick you right back in the water next turn. That's just, that's just too much. Way too much. But the bunny's been going after your stuff. Alright, Koi, I need to find you a mate sooner rather than later. Hit the tree. So, I am thankful for your little bit of dexterity. Last, that is the last of my turns. Well then. Alright. Let's come over here and zoom out a little bit more. Try to get them all. There we go. Okay. Yes. Yes, you are both pregnant. Not pregnant. Sick. But I was right, you can't get each other sick. This is her last day. I need her on a nest ASAP. There we go. Okay. Really little bunny. Stop it. There are roots over here. Levi, I think it's gonna be your job to keep an eye on that baby for a minute. So let's see, that was the two sick people. Nice. Okay. That worked. Yeah, it's gonna be your job to keep an eye on that baby, buddy. I'm gonna send Kunuro this direction to go gather up some roots from that side while you decide what you're doing with yourself. Okay. Can you not? You can't. Okay. Well. Um, she does have the beaver tail, so she should be able to do a little bit of swimming. Oh yeah, look at that. Happily happen more bits and bobs to be able to grab. And then let's see, Rose can come up and help out with some of the things we need help with. We definitely need help with those bunnies. Bunnies galore. turns. Put you right back up against that tree. And actually, Mama Comet can come over. Tala can run over into that nest. Oh, hey, Bantuta. Can you grab? Very much can. Alright, and then we have Rose take up his spot. And then, um, Macy can jump across. Look at that. Very quickly. Get over here. And that means Beaver, who actually is her daughter, can potentially grab that mole. 
Let's have the Yeti jump up here. So she can do that. There we go. Very good. Yeti can come meet his big sister. Um, yeah, that's, that's enough. Right there. Very good. And then we'll have Finn go on ahead and gather up as much of this as he can. Little baby Onyx, jump around him. Um, and it's actually everyone off of these two islands, so... Well, besides you guys. So let's have Rose Quartz try to do that, and we'll have... Misi going ahead and head out a little bit to help with the grass situation we have going on over here. I might actually have some of the guys from this island come over in just a moment to help out. You finally cleared both of those berry bushes. Right in time, too, because... We need some help with these. Do you have you have the hammer tail? Really look at that. You can't grab nuts. You can't grab those acorns. Shame on you. Not really. Oh, that is your home. That was your home island. What am I doing? No, you guys need to go to a different island. There. Y'all are gonna go to that tiny island over there. Or, I can have them meet up with the main creatures and the, the ones on this island and try to have some mixing of genetics. That sounds like a better idea. Better idea. Um. Oh right, yeah, we'll have them loop around come meet on that island. Very good. It's going to take you an entire day to get across this island. <sighs> the bunnies. How dare they come steal your things. Hit the tree. Who wants to do it? Really, there's regrowable grass around that one spot. Okay, she can go ahead and grab that one. And we can have Shark come up, grab this one. And then home and C, I and K. Why not? y'all go across the island as well because we need to and actually that means that you guys need to move on as well if at all possible home and k home and k i and k I want Koi and Coral to have children, but these are their very young baby sisters. Much younger baby sisters. Dang it. I 
might could have wild meat with one of them, but so feels weird. Okay. Is that everyone? Already. That is everyone. Okay. Let's come and meet our two newest babies. And we had someone pass. Oh, we had three babies. I forgot we were having three. I already forgot we were having three babies born. How, how did I do this? Okay. So let's see. Oh my goodness! We finally had it! The gills with the tail fin. And he can only pass on tail fin and only pass on gills. Oh goodness. That is so nice to finally see. And he has spots and they're gray spots. So, let's see. Um. I already have. See, we already have Leon 2, Oranda, Ryukin, Walkin, Butterfly, Tamasaba. And. Oh boy. Let's do Shukin. Welcome to the tribe of land. There is another species of goldfish called Shukin. Okay, and then let's see. Oh my gosh. So happy we have this little baby. Alright, and let's see his niece. Water body and fishing tail. Very good to see. Very, 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 very good to see. Um, we need some more fishers. Um, let's see. I'm gonna name her. Another one of Troy Shipley's names. This is gonna be Gold. She has that nice, nice golden yellow color. Very gorgeous baby. I think it, I think it fits. Welcome to the tribe, little one. And then we have our last baby, a little baby boy. Their only child. We fixed his eyesight, thank goodness. He has normal blood clotting, a slightly low fertility rating, but that is something we can work with and get better over time. No um, pattern. We didn't. We weren't able to fix the um, body or anything like that. But that is absolutely fine. I'm gonna name him. He kind of... Kind of was a last minute baby. Kind of like he, um... He... Crashed in. So welcome to the tribe crash. Thank you, Troy, for that other name as well. You gave several names in one comment and I I am going to use them all. Thank you so much for all of those names. And there's actually a few more on this that I am going to use very much. So, um, that's all the time we have for today, unfortunately. We are using up uh, two turns worth in a day. But yeah, we had three absolutely gorgeous babies. I am going to retire them as a breeding pair, finally. Um, we don't need any more babies from them. We have an abundance of their children. Uh, let's see. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. And actually, I think there's more over there. Let's see. Yeah, Finn. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight children. Yeah, I think they've had enough children. So, I think both of them are going to quit having babies for a while. And we're going to have to see if we can have babies from anyone else. Um, Audrey needs to book it because I want her to be babysitter for that child, at least until it ages up. Levi needs to book it to make it across. I accidentally had him baked, didn't I? Book it to make it across to this island because he needs to help with all the berry bushes. But yeah, um, we're doing pretty good so far. I do want to get them more in the water again, but it's hard. Hard to get them in the water sometimes. But yeah, thank you guys so much for joining me. Um, if you could, do please leave a like, comment, leave your naming suggestions in the comment section, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next one. Thank y'all. Bye-bye.